Surah at tauba Understanding its unique start, content, lessons, and benefits. Surah at tauba is the ninth chapter of the Qur'an and is distinct in that it does not begin with the phrase Bismillah ir-Rahman ir-Rahim, in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. This omission is significant and has been the subject of scholarly discussions. One reason for this is that the content of Surah at tauba is notably stern and severe, dealing with issues of treaties, conflicts, and the punishment of those who oppose the Islamic community. The absence of Bismillah at the beginning is seen as an indication of the Surah's intense and uncompromising tone, setting it apart from the other chapters of the Qur'an. Surah at tauba addresses several critical themes relevant to the early Muslim community during the Prophet Muhammad's peace be upon him, time. It begins with a declaration of immunity, stating the end of treaties with the polytheists who repeatedly broke their covenants with the Muslims. This declaration emphasizes the necessity for the Muslim community to disassociate from those who persist in hostility and disbelief, reinforcing the importance of loyalty and protection of the community's integrity. The surah also commands the Muslims to prepare for and engage in jihad, or struggle, against the disbelievers and hypocrites. This directive underscores the necessity of defending the Muslim community and highlights the importance of unity and strength in the face of opposition. By calling for active resistance against those who seek to harm the community, Surah at tauba emphasizes the significance of standing firm and striving for justice. In addition to addressing external threats, Surah at tauba critiques the behavior of hypocrites within the Muslim community. These individuals pretended to be Muslims but secretly worked against the interests of the community. The Surah exposes their deceitful actions and warns of severe consequences for their duplicity, teaching Muslims about the dangers of hypocrisy and the importance of sincerity in faith. Despite its stern tone, Surah at tauba also highlights the themes of repentance and forgiveness. It calls upon the believers to seek Allah's mercy and purify themselves from their sins. This aspect of the Surah serves as a reminder of Allah's boundless compassion and the hope for redemption, encouraging Muslims to continuously strive for self-improvement and seek forgiveness for their shortcomings. Furthermore, Surah at tauba emphasizes the need for the Muslim community to support the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, and adhere to his guidance. It reinforces the importance of following righteous leadership and maintaining unity within the community. By highlighting the role of the Prophet as a source of guidance and mercy, the Surah underscores the significance of supporting and upholding the principles he established. Reciting and understanding Surah at tauba offers numerous benefits. It strengthens one's faith and commitment to Islam by emphasizing loyalty, sincerity, and repentance. The Surah provides clear moral and ethical guidance, helping Muslims navigate complex social and personal situations with integrity and righteousness. Understanding the historical context of Surah at tauba enhances one's appreciation of the challenges faced by the early Muslim community and the divine wisdom in the guidance provided to them. The Surah's emphasis on repentance and forgiveness serves as an inspiration for Muslims to seek Allah's mercy and strive for self-improvement. It encourages a constant process of self-reflection and spiritual growth. Additionally, the surah's call for unity and support for righteous leadership fosters a sense of collective responsibility and mutual support within the community. Surah at tauba with its unique omission of Bismillah and its stern yet merciful content, offers profound lessons for Muslims seeking to strengthen their faith and navigate the complexities of life. It calls for loyalty, sincerity, repentance, and unity providing both spiritual guidance and practical wisdom. By reciting and understanding its verses, Muslims can draw closer to Allah, fortify their moral and ethical foundations, and contribute positively to the well-being of their community. Reflecting on Surah at tauba one is reminded of the delicate balance between justice and mercy that characterizes the divine guidance in the Qur'an.
the Surah's stern warnings are tempered by the ever-present opportunity for repentance and forgiveness, highlighting the compassionate nature of Allah. This balance serves as a source of inspiration for Muslims to strive for righteousness while remaining hopeful in Allah's mercy. As we navigate the challenges of our lives, let us draw inspiration from Surah at tawbah seeking to embody its lessons of loyalty, sincerity, and unity. May we continually strive for self-improvement, seek Allah's forgiveness, and support one another in our collective journey towards spiritual fulfillment. In doing so, we honor the timeless wisdom of the Qur'an and strengthen our connection with the Divine. Surah at tawbah offers several critical lessons that are relevant both to the historical context in which it was revealed and to the contemporary lives of Muslims. The chapter underscores the significance of loyalty to the Muslim community and the necessity of severing ties with those who are hostile towards it. This teaches Muslims the value of solidarity and the importance of protecting the integrity of the community. Moreover, the Surah's critique of hypocrisy addresses a timeless issue that every community faces. By exposing the behavior of the hypocrites, Surah at tawbah warns Muslims about the dangers of hypocrisy and the need for sincerity in faith. It encourages self-reflection and honesty in one's relationship with Allah and the community. The power of repentance is another profound theme in this surah. Despite its stern tone, Surah at tawbah emphasizes Allah's mercy and the opportunity for repentance. It calls upon the believers to seek forgiveness and purify themselves from their sins. This lesson serves as a reminder of the boundless compassion of Allah and the hope for redemption. Additionally, the command for jihad in the surah is a call to defend the faith and protect the Muslim community. It teaches Muslims the importance of striving for justice and standing firm against oppression. The necessity of jihad, in its broader sense, extends to personal struggles against one's own shortcomings and societal efforts to uphold justice and righteousness. Support for leadership is another crucial lesson from Surah at tawbah The Surah emphasizes the need to support righteous leadership and adhere to the guidance of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. This lesson underscores the importance of unity and following the example of the Prophet in all aspects of life. By reflecting on his life and teachings, Muslims can find a model for ethical behavior, compassion, and steadfastness. Reciting and understanding Surah at tawbah offers numerous spiritual and practical benefits. It strengthens one's faith by reinforcing the principles of loyalty, sincerity, and repentance. The Surah provides clear moral and ethical guidance, helping Muslims navigate complex social and personal situations with integrity and righteousness. Understanding the historical context of Surah at tawbah allows Muslims to appreciate the challenges faced by the early Muslim community and the divine wisdom in the guidance provided to them. This historical awareness enhances one's appreciation of the Qur'an's relevance and timelessness. The emphasis on repentance and forgiveness in the surah serves as an inspiration for Muslims to seek Allah's mercy and strive for self-improvement. It encourages a constant process of self-reflection and spiritual growth. Additionally, the surah's call for unity and support for righteous leadership reminds Muslims of the importance of solidarity and cooperation within the community. This lesson fosters a sense of collective responsibility and mutual support. Surah at tawbah with its unique omission of Bismillah and its stern yet merciful content, offers profound lessons for Muslims seeking to strengthen their faith and navigate the complexities of life. It calls for loyalty, sincerity, repentance, and unity, providing both spiritual guidance and practical wisdom. By reciting and understanding its verses, Muslims can draw closer to Allah, fortify their moral and ethical foundations, and contribute positively to the well-being of their community. Reflecting on Surah at tawbah one is reminded of the delicate balance between justice and mercy that characterizes the divine guidance in the Qur'an. 
The Surah's stern warnings are tempered by the ever-present opportunity for repentance and forgiveness, highlighting the compassionate nature of Allah. This balance serves as a source of inspiration for Muslims to strive for righteousness while remaining hopeful in Allah's mercy. As we navigate the challenges of our lives, let us draw inspiration from Surah at tawbah seeking to embody its lessons of loyalty, sincerity, and unity. May we continually strive for self-improvement, seek Allah's forgiveness, and support one another in our collective journey towards spiritual fulfillment. In doing so, we honor the timeless wisdom of the Qur'an and strengthen our connection with the Divine. Surah at tawbah serves as a guiding light, reminding us of the importance of loyalty to our community, sincerity in our faith, and the boundless mercy of Allah. By internalizing its teachings, we can enhance our spiritual growth, contribute to the well-being of our community, and live our lives in accordance with the divine principles of justice and compassion.